We dragged our souls in black canvas bags through deserts under dark blue light to nothing. None of us were soldiers. We were thirsty. Upon the wind's command, upon your whispered voice, we came to find you panting in a mirage with feathers of newspaper spinning off your arms. You were bent down by a pool of sand. On the first golden dune of the day, my brother lay dying. We had no water, so we knelt around his body and opened a soul bag above his chest. A silver bird crooned through the sound. It was like aluminum. The bird's body vanished between its wings. My limp brother laid covered in sand, just like a bone. You were still frenzied. We left you in your translucent fear and we said a prayer to the radiance of the red day still shining without its beauty. Then came a chill. So we buried our hands in the sand. I thought I would feel the warm earth, but instead there was the satin of a freeze. We saw the moon's eyes. Some of us slept on our soul bags for comfort. Some stayed awake chattering about how they lost their virginity to quiet women. A young man said he loved his mother because she nearly killed his father in a kitchen fire. He asked, does that mean anything to you? I was preparing to die that night. But with my last dry words, I told the world to follow you. The way you were shaking and parched and and your soul was, and your soul was brightly pillaged. You gave us no place to stay. Thank you.